the feud between Benjamin Markowitz, Nicholas's older half-brother, and Jesse James Hollywood, a mid-level drug dealer, began over the alleged $1,200 debt owed to Hollywood by Markowitz. On August 6, 2000, Hollywood, Jesse Ruggie, and William Skidmore decided to confront Benjamin. On their way to see him, however, they saw Nicholas Markowitz walking on the side of the road, having run away from home. Hollywood and his gang decided to abduct Nicholas in broad daylight in order to hold him for ransom in lieu of Benjamin Markowitz's debt. They chased, assaulted, and abducted Nicholas, then escaped in a van. When Hollywood and his gang informed Nicholas of why they were holding him, he allegedly panicked at first. However, after Hollywood offered Nicholas drugs and alcohol, he felt that he was a part of the group. Hollywood and his gang then picked up Brian Affronti, another one of Hollywood's friends, then they drove their van up to Santa Barbara, California and traveled to various house parties. Reports indicate that many witnesses' parents and teens alike saw the group together but did not realize anything was wrong. Although up to 32 witnesses knew he had been kidnapped, even calling him Stolen Boy, they did not notify the police, as Nicholas appeared to be safe and having fun. Nicholas and Ruggie then traveled to the Lemon Tree Inn in Santa Barbara, California. While at the inn, the gang held another party in the pool area of the inn where Nicholas befriended a 19-year-old girl. After the party, members of Jesse's gang allowed Nicholas to believe that he would soon be freed. Instead, Hollywood called Ryan Hoyt, a crew member of Jesse's gang who owed him $200, to take care of Nicholas, giving him a Tech-9 semi-automatic firearm. The decision was made to commit the murder in the Santa Inez Mountains, close to West Camino Cielo Road, north of Goleta, California. Hoyt and Jesse Ruggie bound Nicholas' hands behind his back and covered his mouth with duct tape. Hoyt then hit Nicholas in the back of the head with a shovel, knocking him into a shallow grave. Hoyt shot Nicholas nine times with Hollywood's semi-automatic pistol and the members of the gang then tried to hide the gun by placing it between the legs of Nicholas' body and covering the body with dirt and branches. However, the grave was too shallow and close to the popular lizard's mouth trail, and Nicholas' body was found on August 12, 2000. Ryan Hoyt, Jesse Ruggie, William Skidmore, and Graham Presley were all arrested following numerous leads to the sheriff's office following the death of Nicholas Markowitz.